In this video, we look at energy in food. The energy content of a food can be measured by burning a known quantity of food in a bomb calorimeter. This is a bomb calorimeter. The sample of food is put in a cup, which is located in an oxygen atmosphere. The oxygen is necessary for the combustion of the food. The heat released during combustion is transferred to a known quantity of water. The temperature of the water increases and the increase in the temperature is recorded by looking at the thermometer. Next, we look at how to calculate the energy content of a food. Here's an example. A 0.78 gram sample of food was combusted in a bomb calorimeter containing 105.10 grams of water. The temperature of the water increased from 15.4 degrees C to 30.6 degrees C. Calculate the energy content of the food in kilojoules per gram. So the equation we're going to use is Q equals MC delta T. Q equals heat. M is the mass of the water. C is the specific heat capacity of water. And delta T is the change in temperature. So let's input those values into our equation. The mass of the water is 105.10 uh, grams. The specific heat capacity of water is 4.18. The change in temperature is 30.6 minus 15.4. So that equals 6,677.6 joules per 0 0.78 grams of food. But the question is asking for our answer in kilojoules per gram. So in the next part, we divide our answer in joules by a thousand to get kilojoules. And we multiply by 1.00 divided by 0 0.78 to go to grams. And then the final answer to two significant figures because our uh, mass of food is two significant figures. The final answer is 8.5 kilojoules per gram.